Hi everyone, in this video I will demonstrate creating a schematic drawing inside of the Visio interface. So here in the Project Explorer, um, select the project you want to work with, and then down on the Files tab here, double click the Visio file that you want to open. And if the project has not already been checked out, you will be prompted to check it out. So choose Yes, that way it will check out to your machine and open in the Visio interface. Here in the Visio interface, I am on the Schematic View tab. So what I'm going to do is pull up the Project Editor here, and I'm going to collapse this list and work within a particular location. And I'll expand my list of products here. Actually, stretch this out a little bit, and we'll start scrolling down here. And I'm going to pull over a few products uh, like these two over here to the drawing page, and they're going to drop the products listing the inputs and outputs, and I'll get to that in a second. Uh, one more thing I want to drop over here is a wire, so let me just zoom in a little bit, pull my project editor back up, and I'll scroll down to my list until I find the wire I want. I'll take one of these HDMI cables over, go ahead and drop that there, and now we'll zoom in so we can look at these shapes. So what you're seeing here uh, are the inputs and outputs that are listed for each of these devices. And that information is stored directly with each product. So if I double click, say, this uh, device over here, you'll notice there is an IOs tab. And this is uh, what is dictating what drops over on the shape itself. There's uh, the inputs on the left, the outputs on the right, each of which have a terminal, a signal, and a label for making wire connections. And the great part about doing a schematic drawing inside of SI is that when you do make wire connections, you are able to run reports against the connections you've made because we store all of the data behind every single shape that's on this page, including the wire. If you double click a wire, this will open up and this is a specific wire that you are selling. So uh, it's very easy to make wire connections here. Uh, each one of uh, the ends of this wire has a little connection point. So what I'm going to do is just scoot this over a little bit and show you how to make a wire connection. So what you can do is grab the end of this, and you can see when you get close to one of these, uh, in this case, output, there's a connection point there, and that will glue to that. And you can then move over, take the other end of your wire, and start dragging it to where you want to connect it. And when you get close, you'll see the connection points. And when you let go, that is now a connected wire inside of uh, our Visio interface. And really, that is the basics of creating a schematic drawing here. Drag over your products. Uh, the inputs and outputs will list. Uh, if not, you'll have to add the inputs and outputs to the data and uh, pull wires from your bill of materials here over to the page and make your wire connections. Uh, I'll go ahead now and uh, show you what a finished schematic drawing looks like. And this is an example of a finished schematic drawing, in this case uh, for a distributed audio system. 